Hey, welcome back to Tarot by Cherie, my my loves, my aquas. How's everybody doing? Uh, I'm restarting the video because my dog was coughing and I just needed to help her out. All right, but we're going to get started on this reading. I had these cards laid out and it looked pretty good, so I didn't want to start over for you. All right, so what I'm seeing here, guys, is a brand new start, a new beginning. For those of you who have been feeling left out in the cold, perhaps financially, um, but definitely just feeling left out in the cold. And in the center, we have the Ace of Wands, all right? So they're saying that this is definitely something positive, all right? This is something that is um, being done with a lot of chutzpah. There is some kind of uh, commitment with this, and it's very creative. Somebody very creative came up with something to help you guys out and it's going to continue to flourish you have this ace of wands here which is a flourishing wand it's also very spiritual my loves it, it actually you know shows a wand coming out of nothingness just coming out of the sky um, and there's a branch that is flourishing leaves are growing on it all right so here i'm seeing uh, this masculine this king of swords um so you are a very giving, loving person. You have like really good energy. However, you know, you do have a, a sticking point. You don't like neediness. Neediness drives you up the wall. You, you just can't stand it. Okay. But over here, I'm seeing you're also, you know, feeling like you're carrying a weight on your shoulders, um, going through a transition, a life's transition so this is big for you like whatever it is it it's it your emotions it's got you just all over the place okay you're even feeling forgetful i heard forgetful all right here i'm seeing this five of cups this is you feeling saddened um so this transition is something uh that's really uh powerful powerful it's affecting you powerfully but in the end, it's going to be, I believe it's going to be something positive. We're going to try to get more on this, but you are a awesome manifester. So, you know, try to come out of this. This five of cups reminds us also to get in a state of gratefulness. And if you can do that, uh, you'll be able to turn around these negative emotions and start this manifestation. All right. Because we're in a period of time where we can do that very easily as long as we're vibrating high. Okay, and now I'm seeing some movement here. Um, this is uh, somebody who's feeling very protective. Um, you're trying to make a decision and, you know, you have to be very assertive um, in making this decision. Okay, and you have to make this decision quickly. All right, and I'm seeing this page of wands over here. This is somebody really smart. So I want to say that I'm talking to a masculine right now who is trying to, um, you're thinking about other people and their feelings and their emotions right now, but you have to make this decision and you have to be assertive because I feel like there's a page of wands here who is going to come in really quick and try to supersede what you're doing. Whether this, I feel like this is kind of like a, a job, a position, an opening, and this person is going to try to, they know you want it. It's something that they know you want, and they're going to try to undermine you and come in and take it from you. Is that making sense? All right, so make sure that, it, you know, you make this decision quickly and assert yourself, assert yourself and do what it is uh, you want to do before this page of wands even gets a chance. Okay, so let's continue. I'm seeing uh, this queen of cups here. This could be um, a masculine or a feminine because I'm, I'm picking up on empath here. You're an empath. What does that mean? Some, some people don't know. All right, that is someone who's very, you might be going through your spiritual awakening. You might be craving time alone right now when you're around people. You get overwhelmed because you pick up on their energy so easily. You're very uh, empathetic, loving, giving. And people will just, when you're out, people will just come up to you and start telling you their whole life story, all their problems. 
you know, uh, they'll seek you out. It's incredible. You know, they just pick up on your energy and they know that you are a light to be followed. Okay. And over here I'm seeing, um, just, you know, feeling kind of, uh, defensive and stuck right now. There's something very negative over here. I feel like you either have one foot in and one foot out of this terrible relationship, I want to say, or situation that is, uh, yeah, it's not good. It's something you definitely should uh, move away from, distance yourself from, okay? And when you do, you're going to be much happier. All right, here I'm picking up on a feminine, all right, and you... Um, this is your family here. Okay. They, someone in your family is, um, just a sneaky person. There's, there's no other way to say it. Okay. They might talk about you behind your back. They're just a negative Nelly. And again, you know, you want to break free of this person. You're not getting anything from them. They don't know how to lift people up yet. They're vibrating low. Um, by putting others down, it makes them feel temporarily lifted. Okay. And you know, you're just feeling, uh, some kind of way about this person ignored. They don't, they don't really, um, want to spend time with you. They're just there to screw with you basically. Okay. If that's making sense. All right here, I'm picking up on this King of Wands. Um, and we have the moon card here. So this is things going on in the background that you are unaware of. And you're kind of waiting for the shoe to drop. You're feeling kind of negative today. All right. Um, you might, your spidey hairs might be up. You might know there's something going on, but you don't know what it is. And it's giving you like this negative kind of feeling. All right. So, but spirit is saying uh, to this king, to you to be very strong right now because there's money coming to you okay this is the part behind the scenes that you're unaware of okay there is a quite a bit of money coming to you okay so you guys you know those of you who are feeling you know just not good today you're feeling kind of down and like you know things are shitty and nothing good's coming in you know this is the message stay strong because there's a lot coming in. There's a lot of finances coming in. This is the Ten of ten of Pentacles, okay? And there's a lot of money involved here. There's a lot of happiness and celebration and material things in the background, okay? So you might be feeling like you're going through some kind of a broken heart or just a downside, even a tower moment, okay? But, you know, <clears throat> there is... Uh, <laughs> very positive things coming my aquas okay so again they want you to try to look at the glasses half full no matter what happens no matter what's going on all right this event i can't wait till it, it, it hits and then it's over so we can move on with our lives um it's kind of given me an icky feeling just the waiting um i don't even know 100 percent exactly what it's going to look like or what it's going to be i just know there's going to be some uh, thing that's, uh, you know, and I, I don't want to spread fear. It's going to look scary, but I, I keep hearing that it's really not going to be anything that is going to harm us, that we don't have to worry about it. We're just going to need to stay in the house until they tell us, um, it's, you know, things are in the clear and it's good to go. All right. There might be some, um, you know, these, these people that came in through the border, there might be some, um, unrest okay something along that line and you might see you know the people in green I talked about it the other day I told you that um in my reading from two days ago I heard something that didn't make sense it was a body of people or something to that effect and I looked it up and it said it, it, it's military okay so you're gonna see those people out there um, so it might look really scary. It might sound scary, but you know, I am getting over and over that you are going to be protected. Just stay in, get pre-prepared. That will make you feel a lot calmer. If you're prepared, have 10 days or more worth of food and water and things that you need. All right. Cause I'm seeing 
that you guys are just really going through it. There is a tower moment uh, that may be coming or you guys, some of you may be experiencing some of that now. All right. Here I'm picking up on a masculine and I feel like I feel like this is more or less a, a masculine energy, the loving, protective energy, okay, along with this Knight of Pentacles, which is some good news coming into us, guys. Good news about this windfall once again, all right? We have the windfall card here and all the positivity coming in for each of us. This card is connected to the thousand years of peace that we've already stepped into, believe it or not, all right? We're not seeing it yet, but we're going to. All right, it's going to be like, it's going to get like weird and crazy and crazier for a, a hot minute. And then after that, everything's going to change for the better, guys. It's going to be heaven on earth. All right, it's going to be like, we're going to be all of a sudden seeing and hearing about all these wonderful, amazing uh, things that are going to sound like they came out of Star Trek. Okay, so... Just get ready for that. Get ready for uh, amazing, beautiful things to come in. All right. Um, here they're saying, get ready for this celebration. Talking about get, getting ready. Also, with this celebration, they have humanity in the middle. They have my aquas in the middle. Okay. All of my beautiful lights, my stars. And they're saying, get ready for this great celebration and this healing that's coming in all right there's healing and celebration coming in to the people all right and there's going to be uh some kind of unitedness with the people people are going to start to unite brothers and sisters we are going to unite we're going to know the truth we're going to see it clearly we're going to unite and we're going to be wealthy. We're going to see this wealth and prosperity coming in. Okay. So this is an amazing layout, guys. In this layout is everything we need. Uh, there's love and unity. There is celebration, healing, and, you know, all of the light. That's who you are, guys. This is the age of Aquarius, by the way. I don't know if you guys know how important you are and what kind of, you know, strength and beauty um, and possibilities, uh, you have here at this time and at the, in this place and time right now, specific, specifically, but again, you know, with this unity, we are all going to be sharing the wealth and the prosperity. This is a time coming like no other guys. And, and I've been trying to get you ready. Okay. Initially when I started my channel, I'll be honest, I started it to slowly wake people up, you know, people and lift you up and get you ready for what's to come. Okay. Because I've known what's coming for a long time. And I am also with you on the daily waiting. Okay. Waiting patiently and lifting up my beautiful lights. I love you all. Don't forget guys, please like, and subscribe the channel and you have a beautiful rest of your day.